Yes. I'm here with Dr. Awab and he is a phenomenal dentist and up for healthy kids and healthy teeth and he just said something amazing about why kids have rotten teeth and whose teeth should be extracted. So please take it on. Well, um, when children come to us with bad teeth, what happens is uh, they've got eroded teeth and they're screaming and crying. We say the child has, does not have an income, has not earned money. The only way that he can get money is from the parents. The parents actually feed them chocolates and the teeth get bad. So what happens is I think the children should not be punished for extracting teeth. The parents should be taken out of teeth because they've actually made that prob problem into a worse problem. Yeah, so. that's right. So actually when, when parents ask me that my kids don't want to eat anything else, um, I also tell them the same thing, that who, who told the kids that this is the food they should be eating? The kids are actually just following you, what you are eating at home. And then, what if somebody wants to eat sweets and chocolates? What is the thing what they can actually do to save themselves and save their teeth? Well, the, well, the chocolates actually, does not, it's, the chocolates are not at fault. The sweets are not at fault. The problem is when they have the chocolates, they don't brush. It gets stuck in the grooves of the teeth and that's not brushed off. So if you have chocolate, maybe I know you don't want to brush right away because you love the taste, the flavor of chocolate that's, that lingers. But probably about 10 minutes or 15 minutes later, you actually go and brush that groove, that area. That only is what's going to save your teeth. Otherwise, children who have chocolates and go to bed, and when they go to bed all day, the, the sweet and the saliva all night actually makes things worse. So chocolates at night is the worst thing to have, but chocolates without brushing is actually the crime that you do. And yeah. parents should actually realize the fact that they're doing a criminal thing to their children for giving them chocolates and not making them brush up. Great, thank you so much and I hope that a lot of you guys out there with kids got this message and it's you who should be punished as Dr. Awab said. So thank you so much, see you later.